Hi everyone, uh, welcome to my vlog. My name is James, uh, indie game developer for Candy Cabinets. And uh, this is going to be my first demo of my new game, Sage Chronicles Mystery at Rowalon Manor. Um, uh, just a quick introduction about me and Candy Cabinets. I'm a C Sharp developer during the day and I develop video games after office. Video games are my passion, so uh, I got hooked during my childhood and I want to create video games to tell my stories and have fun and you know I'm hoping to make this my full-time business in the future so that's why I created Candy Cabinets um, uh, for the past three years uh, I was developing mobile mobile games but uh, I feel I can do better on PC now uh, Sage Chronicles not really my first PC game idea but I feel it has a good chance to connect to desktop players. Um, it's RPG, uh, I'm going to put in roguelike elements. It has magic and it's pixel art, so this is going to be fun. Um, for this demo, I'm going to show you how I did my character builder. Uh, so let's go for it. Mm, cool, so um, let's open up the latest build. Sweet. Uh, yep, yep, just the game title. Uh, nothing fancy. Uh, no, no animation yet. No background music. Just the game title that I actually created a couple of uh, days ago. So yeah, let's move on. Sweet. Um, this is the save load uh, game panel. Um, yeah, as you notice, uh, I've been playing around with uh, the character builder. Uh, this is one of my goals for the week as well. Uh, so to have uh, the character that I build saved uh, to disk. So yeah, uh, I just created uh, six slots for the profile. Uh, and yeah, uh, I'm just showing you uh, when you save the, uh, the, the profile, you will see the uh, uh, the character's avatar, just the head for now, and then the name, and a couple of attributes, and probably the location. Uh, and yeah, uh, I'm pretty happy that this uh, I've got this uh, you know done as well this week. So let's move on to creating a character. Let's uh, pick a free slot, and let's create a character. Cool. So this is my uh, character builder panel uh, again uh, just basic uh, character builder you have your um, animated uh, avatar here just an idle avatar uh, animation and then at the right side you can uh, you have your um, avatar uh, folder panels which has the avatar look and then you have your avatar color and then you have your character um, attributes. I've just put in four attributes at the moment. Um, the basic uh, RPG attributes, constitution, strength, dexterity, and intelligence. And lastly, you have your uh, character class, or which I call sage class. I just put in you know, two uh, class at the moment, just uh, mage and wizard. Um, in future vlogs, blogs, I will probably, you know, um, explain what's the difference between wizard and mage. But for now, just this. And then at the right top, I've put in uh, the available or free attribute points. I just put in 100 at the moment. Um, not sure if that will stick because uh, you know, I haven't actually did any gameplays to you know see how it will feel when I actually put in the attributes but yeah and then we have here your name so I can just put in the name for your character so let's put in my name cool that's it let's create our first character um, going back to the uh, details panel you have the race which is I just put in two, human and elf, and uh, cool, nice point years. And I have the eyes, you can customize the eyes. I have, how many eyes? 
12 eyes to choose from uh, yeah just basic uh, eyes for your pixel art character then you have hair uh, styles I think I put in 10 yeah 10 hairstyles again basic uh, hairstyles for pixel art you can choose the colors colors for the skin um, yeah oh Elf has only two colors. Let's move on to human. Human. Here we go. Yep. Human has more colors. Yep. Pretty diverse. Cool. Now let's uh, change the color of the eyes. You have. Let's put in the purple. Nice. And then let's uh, choose a hair color. Um, yellow. Yellow. Yeah. That looks good. And then you can distribute your uh, uh, free uh, attribute points, which is just go here. I can remove a couple of attribute points here. Yeah. And I can choose my class, Mage and Wizard. Cool. Well, if, if you're feeling lazy actually creating your character, I put in a random generate button here so that when you click that it will randomly generate your character very neat it will also generate your you know your name and yeah and the name will actually be based on the hairstyle so i what i did was i made sure that if it is a guy hairstyle or a girl hairstyle or maybe gender gender neutral hairstyle if it's a gender neutral hairstyle it will also randomly pick between a female and male name so as you can see it's chosen yeah it is female name Zupi Tira uh, for that hairstyle and it will auto generate you know uh, the look it will auto generate the skin color so if i generate this you can see it will just randomly pick one if you choose that one the color it will randomly generate and also it will auto distribute your uh, uh, points or attribute points as you can see that All right. it also randomly picks your class right and if you're not happy with it just you know click on the reset button that i put in here and we'll just reset it to the default pretty neat it's a uh, generate one cool that's looking good a blue haired elf now to save just uh, click on the next button saved in memory there you go oops just a blank panel for now this is my next uh, goal for next week uh, you know just to start the journey I, I want to show a summary of the character build before you actually go and play the game but you know it all already works just click on the play button here and it will save it to disk it will save it to the free slot that we've actually picked a while uh, earlier cool so it just moved to the game title just for now you know just to show you that it actually saves it moves to the game title so let's go back and see how it goes there you go there's the blue haired that we created awesome so it's working now uh, if you're not happy with uh, you know your, the, the character build you can definitely just delete it just click on the uh, delete here we'll just ask you oh you sure delete this game or this profile oh, need to change it yep and it will delete it from this okay cool so let's choose another one let's create another one Ooh, oh i like that one oh. click too too fast i want to do silver here oh. let's do silver here silver here there you go nice oh, broad chick Let's save that okay sweet here you go awesome so hope you like this demo i'm uh, pretty excited to create this game um i still have a long ways to go 
but you know i'm having fun i'm excited to actually share uh, what i've done so far with you guys um, i hope you support me on my game dev journey you know follow me uh, on my website candy cabinets i have a blog there and also follow me in my social media accounts which is just you know a candy cabinets uh, social media accounts so yep um hope to see you all soon on my next blog uh stay safe and always have fun bye